Hello, buddy. My name is Mr. Bonesy, and welcome back to Alien Isolation. Now, in the last episode, we dealt with the alien quite a few times, and, uh, he's still fucking here, of course. I realize kicking props like this actually alerts him, so... Oh, I thought that was him. It's just this door. I'm stupid. Because apparently... Or at least I think I have to look at this first. And, like, read. Because <laughs> I think I read it, but I think I went by too fast. I wish you could... Uh... Okay, anyways. I need to talk to you. I've got a body up here. The part of the Marshall investigation. Female, late 30s. Uh, chest wound. I have no idea how long Marshall's wait. We'll keep her up here. But this is a highly sensitive situation. I'm going to need you to discuss... I hate the sounds. I really hate the sounds. Um, I also need to see you uh, come to our office. And then Frank, I'm concerned about uh, locked out has been noted 100%. Um, okay. Well, I don't know what I just did, but I did something. Yes, I didn't do that last time. I didn't click that last thing. I wonder if that'll let me in that room now. Activated coolant. And of course, there's like something missing here. Oh, he's right there. My alien friend. He's just in the uh, things. So I need something here. Um, I don't know. I got the stuff to the right of me. Open. I wonder if that makes the door open. It does! Ah, that's why I was stuck last time. Uh, if you saw a video I made earlier about how I just now fixed OBS, or I was fixing OBS. Let me pause because I'm don't. i too scared that I grab that and start something. Uh, I was lost. I got that stun baton, which is in this area. And then I was like really confused. So I went back in the elevator and then I went to that area and the alien killed me like multiple times. But other than that, I didn't make progress. I just got the stun baton. I'm too scared to grab this, but. I don't. I don't like it. Was that a different door I heard? I don't know. I don't like this. That was too easy. That was way too easy to get access to that room. I don't like this. I'm scared. Okay, I thought I... The sounds are so creepy. I, I It sounds like, like a snake slithering around or like, you know... Uh, you know, it's not normal. The general thought would think alien. Why did I come in here? What was the point? Oh, rewire. Samuels, there's a Dr. Lingard, senior medical officer. Should be able to find out where they're keeping everything in her office. Good luck, Ripley. Hurry if you can. I think I know what that vent access gave me. <laughs> just punching in my punch card an average day of work for an average joe like me <laughs> why did he come through
<laughs> okay. 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 How did he know, though? <laughs> Thanks for the hand. <laughs> Find a weapon, hitting surface, and a detonating hand-built devices will attract unwanted... I didn't do anything. I thought that was saying, like, giving me advice, because I did get a stun baton. But no. Alien just said, fuck you. How do I get past them? There's a hiding spot here. There's a hiding spot there. Okay, so if I pull that out. Okay. I'm just climbing up the ladder, climbing up the ladder, going up on the ladder, going. Going up the ladder, going down the ladder, going up and down and uh, down the ladder. Okay. Okay. Going up down the vent, hiding in a room that looks very familiar. <laughs> Why? Are you fucking kidding me? He's in that room over there. Hi. Right, Tom. I have several questions. This is one of them. <laughs> I didn't know it was like right behind me. <coughs> oh my god, I got like an itch in my throat. Alien killed me so many times I could virtually feel his other mouth in mine. That sounds weird, but <laughs> uh, we ignore it. I wish I had something to stun him with. Why does that look like a texture? I should be safe here. Technically, I'm hiding. Oh, that's a better hiding spot. Okay. Way better. 
I think it's over there in this room. I'm hoping it's in this fucking room. Oh, there's a lot of hiding spots. I hit, I kicked cans. Give me a moment. I, uh, uh, no, trauma ward. Uh, that sound like shoes. Uh, oh, empty. Fuck. Oh, how sad. Death. No audio. <gasps> oh, God, see. This is Senior medical officer at Sevastopol Station. I want to. I want to state. I have been, I have been placed under duress with regards to my patient zero. And Ransom, Seekson's head of operations, he. He made certain threats for my career and my certification. I want that on record. God, that woman needed help. I didn't know what type of parasite she had encountered, but it had planted something inside her. I am so sorry. I had no way of knowing what would happen. That was a chest. Can I stop kicking over fucking cans? What cans am I kicking over? Uh, that was a chest burster. Or, I'm not sure if that's the actual name for them, but that was a face hugger. I know that's an actual name. My luck. That scared the shit out of me to the point where I didn't. I, I actually, I was actually more concerned of the alien coming around. I just don't like how he's going in a little circle. I guess he can't now. Okay, he's right there. I'm assuming he's on the other side of the fire. I think he went up in a vent. Okay. I wish I could fucking save. I think I don't want to die. Oh, he doesn't know how lockers work. How cute. It just sounds so fucking close. Oh. This sucks. I'm so quiet because I'm just not wanting to die. I wish there was a save.
He definitely fucking heard me. He was right there. No possible way. I was fucking right. I was fucking right to get in here. He's like, he's like right outside that door. Oh, I hate doing it, but this is my better safe than sorry strat of just making sure I'm not doing fucking anything and hiding for two hours. <laughs> oh, hi. Hi, friend. Can you leave? It'd be very cool if you left. Aw, oh, but you went the way I wanted to go. I found the right way to go! Oh my god! Oh, I thought the fan was in for half a second! I panicked! Oh my god! Okay. My heart beats beating out of my chest. I found the right of way. There's a safe sound! Oh, hi! You came from a direction I never went to, so that concerns me. Um, what you doing in here? Your o is this your office? Wow, I didn't know! Why are you going over here exactly? Your locker's locked. I'm so glad it didn't connect. I did not mean to click. I clicked out of pure frustration and panic. Yeah, that sounds like a vent. Event to be aware of because there's one right there. Okay, a fucking course. Oh, hurry up. Oh. Thought he was behind me. <laughs> but he is definitely coming in. He's definitely entering. He he felt the sensation. <laughs> He's like the world's saving for some reason. He checked the safe spot. You're oddly close. You're oddly close. <gasps> Maybe this was his office. It, it said something. Like, it gave me, like, a quick time, I think. But it was so fast, I didn't get the... Did he... You don't have eyes, though, so, like, what? <laughs> it's hard to tell. Oh, he's in that build. He's in the room. You can see his legs. Those nice, thick legs. Those thighs. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. <laughs> he definitely didn't like the compliment about his thighs. I'm gonna try to read the text that appeared for two seconds. God damn it! Stop giving me quick times! This is bullshit! You can't just throw in like six of them at me! I, I thought it said right mouse when I. He 
he just fucking left, dude. He's like, boom. All right, time to get a coffee. <laughs> what the fuck? You can't do this to me. You can't, like... Oh. He went to a vent. I think he was in the other room. He was. Bitch try- Ha ha! Not a big ha ha. There's no reason for to come over you. You are coming over here. Please don't give me the quick time. Thank you. Is he going to the other room? Hard to tell. I'm definitely fucking dead though. God, okay, I tried. <laughs> Such a little asshole. Why is he coming back? Well. Oh my god. I did it. You dead ass? Dead ass. Dead ass? Dead ass? Dead ass? Dead ass? I'm not gonna move. Not moving. Oh! Why? Just give me a. There's no. Avoid making loud noises. What noises? The sounds of my pitter patter? What the fuck? I've died so many times in this episode. It's not even funny anymore. It's just pain. Oh. You know what? I'm gonna call it here and then try to survive, or at least do the successful survive tactic in the next episode. Yes, I did bring out a comb out of nowhere to brush my hair. <laughs> oh my god. If you guys like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'm dying. <laughs> this sucks. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya!